welcome to World of Bridging and Extensions. Today we're going to be doing something really exciting, something I thought will really be a benefit to you, especially those of you who have mastered the art of braiding and designing. So we want you to have something extra in your hands and that's why, as usual, not being selfish with the knowledge I have, I'm happy to come and share this new knowledge with you. My name is Joy Fido and welcome on board. So what's this exciting thing? It's the hair that I'm wearing and I'm hoping you can really see this. But this is what they call the million twist. We have them in million braids as well, like tiny, tiny braids and million twist, tiny, tiny twist. They're extremely small. And we call them the Mezzi Million Twist Braid. Mezzi, M-E-Z-I. So this particular hairstyle is one of the latest things going on at the moment. You have them in so many different colors and so many combination of colors and so many different lengths. So if you're used to what we've been doing on this channel, which is giving you skills to empower you, we want you to be even more empowered. And so the whole idea of today's video is to show you how to create this amazing unit. So you can again add more knowledge into your hands and put more money in your pocket. So for people who just don't want to deal with the skill, this particular hair style is available with us. And we have them in varied colors and varied lengths. So feel free to visit our website, which we're gonna put um, in the description box below to order yours. When we started introducing them slowly, um, we had quite a few inquiries, people asking, can we deliver it to them? And where are we sending it to? And where can we send it to? And all those kind of questions. When will it be available? Yes, they are available now, and what could happen is you could send us your specification as in the length you want and the color you want and, you know, the combination of colors. So all of that is available for you to make your choices. And when you make the inquiry, we can then tell you the lead time, how long it's going to take before this is done. So these are the Mezzi Million Twist Wigs, if you don't understand it as units. We love to call them units. Some people love to just understand it by weeks. So let's get started on this. Okay, so what materials do we need to be able to achieve this amazing look with this special units? The first thing you could be looking at is a wig. Um, this texture is kind of wavy or curly, but it does not matter as long as you can see strands of hair to work with. That's what counts. And so this wig then becomes what you're going to start braiding and twisting as the case may be. So a wig is the first thing, that's one way. The other way is a net, a net. And they usually call them weaving net. These nets have got to have holes in them. And it's these holes that we actually do the work on. And let me carry on with the, with the net first. What do we need? is our crochet needle so crochet needle just goes in there and introduces the extension into the spaces in the net and then you're able to do your weaving or braiding as we will have it and the other thing you need is the hair extensions so the hair extensions this particular one is our bundles of joy unit Bundles of joy, um, which again, we've had so many people order this hair from time to time. The beauty with the bundles of joy is this is already prepared. This hair is prepared, ready to braid. So you don't have to go through the trouble of trying to create this hair for you to be able to braid with. So we have done all the hard work and all you do is just get on with your work. So that's the hair that does the job. And what's the other thing you might need? Um, naturally you need a brush to brush the hair very well in order for you to work with it and then the next okay, big so thing we'll get on with this first thing you do is then get your hair 
so you can see from here um, I've started working on this particular one and this is on a wig base so you can see um, the lace part of the wig it's sitting on a base of a training head so what you could do is have a head that maybe you're not really using what I've done here is I have a wig cap sitting on this training head and this particular training head has I've played with it so much I've cut the hair a billion times so it's not really doing anything for me so fantastic for me to use it to um, create this wig so that's what I'm using here the other one Okay, when I get to it, I'll tell you what happens there. But let's concentrate on the wig base. So this is one that I've started with a wig base and I want to show you how to actually create the strands of this million braids or million twist. Now the great thing with this is in training, when I train students, we obviously have the a million braids twist in class. Uh, usually we call it the human hair uh, pick and drop braids. Now what you find is some people really really have a natural tendency to enjoy picking strands of hair, really really small strands. And so I have lots of students who are absolutely brilliant with this and then there are people who cannot hold tiny strands of hair and all they want to do is do the major jumbo strands. So if you can handle really small strands of braids this will not be a problem for you but of course i'm going to show you our home training dvd pack again for you to be able to start picking up skills like this which can then automatically be turned into a product because this is a product and what is a product a product is something that you can sell without you being physically involved at that time which is why I'm so excited about this because I can equip the hands of people who are working with me to gradually move from just working with clients one to one and start creating products that they can sell across the world. So you sit on your own, take your time, create this and then sell it. It makes life a lot easier than standing with somebody 24 seven trying to create amazing hairstyles on them. So that's, that's the reason we really want you to know how to do this. Okay, so now we're starting. Um, you get your strands of hair. Now make sure they're as small as you can handle them. Um, what you find is some people really can handle really small. Again, the whole idea is to give this hair the strands that makes it feel like it's individual strands of hair. That's the whole idea. So the smaller the strands, the better. And so naturally, I work from the station where I put my things so what I do is line them out to what I want and so I'll just put a few on that tray and then I'm ready to braid so the first thing I do now the, the thing with million braids is you don't need a comb that's why I haven't shown you a comb once you've got the line you can see what I have here I'm just taking the line of the weave or rather the wig so what you find normally in a wig is lines of hair, strips of hair going across. So I take a strip and then I use my hand and just take a tiny section, as tiny as I can. I don't need a comb to do this. So my hand can just pick this. And then of course the clip comes in. I didn't mention clip, but yeah, we need clip in everything we do with designing hair. So that's my strand of hair. And then next thing I need is water. Again, I didn't show water, but naturally when I'm twisting, I need water. So water just drenches it a little bit and I naturally drench the extension I'm going to work with. Why? Because it helps me to hold the hair better. Um, I was in Nigeria recently where this hair is really quite popular. And I noticed that what they did was they preferred to use creams. So they use cream and they put cream on their hand and they're touching and they're putting on the hair. I generally prefer water whenever I'm braiding. Okay, so we get the extension 
and then we'll get the strand of hair now this way of twisting we've done a video on it before in the past it's okay so you get your strand of hair and remember the two strand the little strand you're ready to work with the root twist is you make the hair sit on the strand of hair you're going to work with and then you separate the client's hair into two once you've done that the hair that you put across is now shared to the strand of hair you hold it down and then you push the hair down and start twisting one side of the strand okay so we mentioned um our training dvds and the home training pack this is the home training pack and it's got over 30 21 different techniques in this one where the senegalese root twist is one of them if you don't have it in the pack we definitely do have it on the download and we have it as a dvd for for you to buy um it's for you to, once you know how to create the root twist that's the most important thing once you know how to create the root twist creating products like this is fantastic for you once you can braid creating products like this are okay for you so this is what we are beginning to think now as um, I love to call us braid designers or natural hair designers. I, I don't like that word braider because when people think braider, they just start to look at you as if you're cheap and you're not worth anything. But when you start thinking braid designer, you're thinking, you're, you're thinking of something and you're creating something amazing. So this is one of the things I would definitely recommend you start learning how to do because it's gonna bring a lot of money into your pocket and that's what we stand here for we always always want to share skills with you that will help to empower you so then pick up your training training pack or get the DVD or download and start learning how to root twist once you can root twist this is easy I will not say to you do the braid twist braid twist makes this look very very untidy so the very, very best way to work on this um, braid units is to do the root twist. And that's why I'm showing this with you and sharing it with you. So I'm going to do a few more strands in this particular one. And then I will move on to the other technique that I, I talked about. Remember I said there's, there's a wig base and then there's a net base. So I'll show you how the net base works as well. Okay, so... Um, I just want you to see how much work I've done here and you can see how we started right from there and then remember what I said you just follow it line by line according to the according to the wig just follow the lines as they are don't go in there and mess around with it see that so it just goes on the lines and then I'm onto this line. Now, another thing I want you to get, I know for people who want this product, because we've had so many inquiries when we first did um, an Instagram video of it. This is just to show you the length we're looking at. This particular one is about 18 inches. Maybe up to about 20, but I would just say for the decent place where the hair is about 18 inches. So when you start ordering and you got your tape, tape measure with you, uh, measure what you want and then when you're sending your order in, you let us know. Um, this one I'm wearing, I don't know how far I'm going to measure it from, but let's say I came from there. It's about 22. The one I'm wearing is about 22 inches. But what we've done here is we layered it. So as the very base is 22, and then it got a bit shorter in front. So that's, I'll say about 18 in front and 22 at the back. So that's what you'll be thinking about when you start putting your orders in. Think the kind of length you want and you let us know. So I'm taking this off and I want to show you the other one which I did tell you there are two ways of doing this. Okay, so this is my really beautiful model. Look at how pretty she is. Ignore her lashes dropping off. Okay. 
beautiful model now we've created this hair from a base of the net so this is the net base and I'll take it off so you can see so what is the benefit of this million twist braids or million braids as the case may be depending on what you go for it's that time that people sit at the you know at the hair hair designers shop for hours and if you were to wear this you're looking at days sometimes so when you got something like this it saves you a lot of that uh it's a protective hair styling because um you then create your basic cornrow underneath and you just put your wig on so this is absolutely brilliant it's one of it's it's one of those things I love so much and I'm going to promote it as much as I can. So at least now that you've seen me create it, you can then appreciate, appreciate it more now that I'm wearing it. This is a big thing going on and we hope we've been able to empower you with another skill today. And we hope you're going to use this and go and create some more things in your life and make, make it better like we all wish for everybody. So thank you so much for buying our DVD. Thank you for watching our videos. Thank you for being there and please if you like this subscribe and remember to share with your friends and remember to like it as well. So we look forward to seeing you in the next video and thank you so much for all the details will be in the description box and thank you again. Bye bye.